welcome to our next episode of Dining with He. We got a special guest. What's up, yo? It's the original G up in the building, <laughs> yeah. holding it down city to city. State to state, I'm in your girl's DMs. Yeah, if you didn't know, it's the kid Gizmo. Yeah, boy. So we about to get some fire ramen. Some yeah. Fire ramen. I'm yo. ignite his head right now to the magic of stuff. <laughs> like fire. It's, hot. it's a little bit hot. But uh, we going to this joint called Ichiran. Now, if you didn't know, Ichiran is considered to be um, the best ramen in Japan. It has like the most universal appeal. Um, the cool thing about Ichiran is you can kind of create your own narrative as far as food. As far as the ramen as far narrative. As the, the ramen narrative, which we're, we are very high on. <laughs> it's a ramen narrative. <laughs> I'm really looking forward to eating this and sharing it with y'all. And of course, as always, on the he we have Ayaka. Yeah. yeah. So, let's get it. Yeah, boy. Yo, we're about to get this Ichiran business, so let's go. Ichiran is a chain ramen restaurant that you can find all over Japan. It originated in Tokyo, but you can find it in other prefectures around Japan. A lot of restaurants in Japan have these little vending machines, especially ramen restaurants where you choose what you want in the beginning and just give the tickets to the waiter or waitress. Egg. Just one. Egg. Mm, green onion. And... Yeah. <laughs> we interrupt your regularly scheduled program for oh, Real hey. Talk with Gizmo. So oh, yeah. my shades inside. And when it's dark outside. <laughs> Super Saiyan douchebag. The lighting and atmosphere in Ichiran is really unique. You have your own personal cubicle. Ichiran kind of originated the make it your own flavor. They give you this little paper that you can circle what kind of things you want in it. For example, how spicy or how much garlic you would like in your noodles. Ichiran is kind of like ninja ramen. You never have to talk to anyone there. You don't see their faces and you never really make eye contact. You just give them your paper and your tickets and they handle the rest for you. Yo, so we just ordered our ramen. Uh, the cool thing about Ichiran is you can control every aspect of your ramen from the soup to the noodle density to whether or not you want to put in green onions or white onions to even meat. So you make your own personalized bowl of ramen. See, me personally, my ramen. Oh yeah. Nigga, you stupid. Fire. 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 I don't know, man. Your ramen game is so far. <laughs> Just like your no. injustice game. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. I'm just saying. We'll show you when it comes out, but it should be good. I'm gonna talk about ramen. <laughs> it's one thing. I talk about my fist. Yeah. You can put your fist in the ramen if you want. And then I'm. <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna get the, the, the ramen fist of Olympus. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. It's fire. Dinner is served. <laughs> One thing you really have to try if you go to Ichiran is the Kaidama set. The Kaidama set really just offers you an extra bowl of noodles that you can put back into the soup. So don't drink all your soup, but it gives you a good chance to really fill up since they don't have other sides like gyoza or karage or other things that other traditional ramen restaurants have. Round one. Finish. 
figure like Donald Trump, you dump it in like that, then you take the ball and you beat a nigga over the head with it. You feel me? The onions, the onions is like the US military, no man left behind bro. <laughs> I don't want them, we gotta get them all in there. No soldier left behind, bro. Happy Veterans Day. Enemies skipping us. All of them. All of them. No soldier left behind. These onions, they went through basic training together, fought the war together. They bring all onions home, man. I <laughs> think you did Thank y'all for coming. Thanks for watching. Eat you on. Man, you see my face. <laughs> <laughs> you look like veterans are gonna come at me now. I respect our veterans. I respect mm. them all. But sometimes you eat them in your ramen. Sometimes I just gotta get these onions in the ramen though. Big up the veterans for fighting and serving and defending the great country of the United States of America.